Hi, this is Angela Murad at Amazing Kids AAC Consulting. Just a quick video to show how to export a page out of one page set and then import it into a different one. This is the aphasia page set, and I do a lot of copying from here, especially with the visual scenes. So I want to make a copy of this page uh, regarding meals. So I'm going to go in here, go into page, export page bundle, and hit export. And I'm going to hit done there, and go into user, go back over to my core first user that I want to import it into. And I'm going to go over to topics and meals. And I already created a large button here. And so I'm going to link to a page, import and link to page. Whoops. Import and link to page. So there's my topics meals two and next and import and so now when I tap that now it's all squunched up because that grid size is different over the aphasia page set and um, so I'm going to go back over and go look and see what that grid size was. Whoops, I have to click done. Visual scenes, meals, and let me see what grid size, six by five. So let me switch back over. Navigate over to my topic, meals, visual scene, page, <clears throat> grid size. I'm going to toggle off this matching and I'm going to set it up as a custom grid size of six by five. And there we go. And then, um, Let's see if this came linked. The script came over with it. I'm going to need to relink it to some meal words. So I'm going to link, link to, and I'm pretty sure there's already meal vocabulary in there. So topic words meals, create, done. There's the script. And yeah, I might, uh, depending on the age of the child, if they know they're allergic to something, I would edit that. But this at least shows you how you can quickly export and then import. Hope this helps.